I have not been recording for like half of this game and for like the two other games before and that is always fun. <laughs> oh my, oh my, oh my, oh my. Do we drop, or we don't drop Aurelia here. We just, we just drop MF. Because he can play removal on her, I don't care. I have Aurelia coming down on five. Right, that's fine. See? We're just doing a lot of face damage with Crackshot Corsair. Um, the thing is, I can't, I can't get a lot of anything on my sparring student. I have no Pify if he wants to Culling Strike. I, I can't get, um, just a lot of plus ones, plus ones on my sparring student, which is unfortunate. I need to draw, like, a scout right now. That would be great. I also don't have that many blockers. Block like this, block like this. Man, that's a lot of damage to face. I didn't even realize. Oh my god, that's a lot of damage to face. I shouldn't have blocked the spider. I mean, it's one more damage, right? It's one more damage. He doesn't have that many blockers too now, though. That's the thing. Oh no, retreat is not what we need. I need a scout. I need a scout, dude. No, I need draw. I did put some uh, some assassins in this deck for draw. I believe, does this break spell shield? It should, right? I could recall Aurelia. I want to bait him into into getting his spell shield procced. And this should this should bait it out. So Z is dying if he blocks there, which is great. If Rune One Runner wants to come and block. Right, Spider's blocking there. He definitely wants to attack with Rune. I'm okay with this. This is absolutely fine. That's such a good trade. That is such good value, dude. Nice. And then we only need one more attack to, to level Misfortune. And she'll be leveled on that attack. Sparring student is pretty pretty okay here. Pretty meh. I see. Okay, so we're just recalling him. We'll, we'll retreat our student. We'll, ret we'll recall Darius and we'll retreat our student. Or maybe we could just do both with Homecoming. That would be that would be ideal. And then we just save retreat for anything else that he might have. Okay, so a blocker for this. Um, And then we have a blocker for this. Safety block doesn't really matter. That's still two. And then we need... I'll recall this, dude. Actually, recalling Aurelia is, is the nuts, yeah? How? How is he doing that? I guess there's no point in blocking, right? No, 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 no. Do this. There's no point in blocking. Unless we just block with Crackshot Corsair to get us down to th up to three. But this kind of sucks right here. I mean, he's losing on open attack, so it's okay. The problem is, I mean, he can't play Decimate. Decimate's slow, right? He actually just can't play it. Now we just attack with everything. And that's not a mistake, because if he can somehow get out of this, which I doubt he can, 
Um, I, c I can recall a bunch of stuff. I can then play dance. It's great. This is so great. You can't get out of this. That's GG. <laughs> FF, dude. FF. I'm not sure there's a way you can get... Yeah, GG. That's great. What is this? Is this the chipmunk deck? Or at least that's what I call it. The... The what is it? I'm not sure quite what to call it. The 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 brigade. You know the the elusive thing that transforms when you play another one of them. This is actually okay. These two are kind of weird. I don't know. I genuinely haven't seen this deck. Don't know what it is. Don't know what I'm into. Could be a she who wanders deck. Maybe. Maybe not. I think we open attack here. Yep. I'll come in a bit. Yep. Alright, he did not end up playing anything. We're not dropping a rally though. Oh maybe we are. Maybe we are. Because we'll get we'll get in a we'll get a blade dance next run anyway, right? I think we just let him hit face, yeah. If he's not going to pre-buff it. Surely he plays something, though. And then we play Scout. I don't think we play Scout though. This is just too good. This is just nuts right here. We get two Blade Dancers. If only we have misfortune to just do one more damage to it. Just a little a little extra nudge, you know? Oh, maybe this is the what do you call it? Elnok deck. Troop of Elnox. Maybe that's it. It could be. It could be. We've got a fat student right here. And I'm guessing he has nothing to play against this yet. I don't think we attack with that. There we go. This is how we attack. Nice! Nice! This is going super well! There's not much you can do against this. So, what? Well, the nuts. The nuts would be a misfortune. Misfortune top deck. Come on, please! Oh, another... That's actually so good too. I don't mind that. With this, we can get... We can get misfortune leveled next round. Three mana do nothing! <laughs> Three mana do nothing, dude! Oh my! He's having a fun time. I think he's dead on open attack, right? <laughs> I think he's genuinely dead on open attack. <laughs> oh no, I feel sorry for the poor man running Troop of Elnox. Oh, that's depressing. Poor Elnox. Here I am recording a couple more games because Upon inspecting my footage, <laughs> I had no footage. This, uh, oh, I I wasn't recording any of it, and it was it was really really painful. And here we go. I've got some more games. Oh my god, this is a terrible hand. I mean, it's not that bad to be fair. Drop double crack shot, Cors Corsair. Let's get him, crew. Why is this dude so tiny? I'll never understand that. Mm. 
Nice. What are we going up against? Sejuani Braun. This should be fine. Manta Chameleon to face. And having two... This actually isn't that bad. Having two of these down is, like, really useful. Hang on, Buzzball. We skip this, we skip this. It doesn't matter. Or really doesn't. Because we have Aurelia, into Blade Dance. Into so much damage to face. He can't keep taking this damage to face, that's the thing. The only downside is he has a blocker now, but I'm pretty sure he can't buff unless he has the Elixir of Iron card, right? Uh, we don't want to play that. We'll play this. Here we go. That's lethal. He has to block. He really isn't having a fun time. We get another Blade Dance card. We could, we could get going here. And if you place any high cost units, they'll just home coming at them. Maybe we do just home coming at this round. I don't mind this. <laughs> I guess I'll do one more game. Oh my god, this deck is actually slapping people around so quick. Holy. So, what we need early is uh, we need MF. Oh my god. When, when I said that I needed misfortune in this matchup, I didn't mean like that. Oh my god, dude, this is the third Zia Aurelia deck in a row. In a row. And this is what I'm talking about. That's the card I need. This is a really good start. These, these are the cards I need to go into this matchup, man. Depends what I draw here. Depends what I draw. Shadow Assassin, I'm playing this. Nice. If he wants to sacrifice his droplet, I don't care. I'll take that trade. That's even better, man. God damn. Oh, Aurelia is really good. Aurelia is just really good. Oh my god, that's nuts. That's nuts. That's a million to face. I think we want to block this. Lock this. Yeah. He could shape stone this. That would be so tragic. No, man. They always... They've had it every single time. Every single time they've had shape stone. Why do I get this matchup, man? Ugh, I can't. My brain actually just can't handle it anymore. Oh, it's disgusting. Holy, that's nice. Holy, that's nice. Oh my god, that's that's one of the best one drops I could have gotten. Is he he can't homecoming? Is he gonna shape start lead and follow? I don't mind that.
Die. Die. You filthy scum. I mean, he can't do any one of these with the Zerelia unless he has another shaped stone, which I doubt he has. And he's running out of draw, and this is pretty good. I think we can win this. Win against the Meta Slaves. That's pretty good. This can block Sand Soldiers. Okay. I mean, he has to choose which one he wants to play this time. Pain. Pain. She has the zero cost card now, because of this. Um, so we sacrifice him, put this dude here, and then I think we're fine. He's going to get another one now. He hasn't actually used his attack token. This is disgusting. There's so much value here. She should die next round, though. I don't know what to do here. I'm genuinely, I, I genuinely have no idea what to do. This is what I'm gonna do, and then next round I'm gonna play this into uh, into into Ribbon Dancer. I like that outcome. Nice. So we do this. That's such a good drop again, man. All right. So before he can do anything, we'll do, we'll do this. Right. And now he only has two cards. I mean, that Aurelia is such a problem, but open attack is so strong here. Oh, uh, I think he's done. I think he's actually done. Like, he can't block everything, right? Oh, my. My, 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 my. My, 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 my. Eat dirt. Eat dirt, meta deck. With an infinitely fast level Aurelia. That was really annoying. But I think we're fine now. There's nothing he can he can he can win with. Nice, GG. I really don't like Azir earlier. I think it's a really unhealthy deck. So I'm happy. I'm happy, man.